Okay, we head over to the system tab and we highlight it. We move down to the file manager. Now, if you have Fusion in here already, you can skip this step. If you don't, you want to go ahead and add the source. And this is the address that you want to paste, HTTP fusion.tv-addons.ag. Now, I will drop that in the description if you want to copy and paste that over. Watch for adding extra spaces or characters in there that can cause problems. Once you've got it, hit done. Sometimes Cody will generate a name, other times it will not. The most logical name for this would be Fusion, of course. So go ahead and enter that and hit done. Press OK. We've now got our source, so we can go back home. This time when we head over to the system tab, we press it with a click. We go into add-ons. We want to install from a zip file. Now, whatever you just called your setup, which was Fusion for my case, hopefully you followed that too, is what we need to select. So press that. We go into the XBMC repos. It's an English category. And what we are looking for is this one, the repository entertainment repo backup 1.12 the number might have changed since i recorded this video go ahead and click that you will get a notification down here in the bottom it says the add-on is enabled now don't go ahead and jump to the next step if you see this if cody's decided it wants to update go ahead and let it don't start installing extra things that can cause problems so go ahead and wait for that update to finish Next, we press install from repository. Now, my setup's going to be a little different to yours. I've got an absolute ton in here because I'm doing some testing. We're looking for the entertainment repo. We go into the video add-ons tab, and there is your add-ons. There's an absolute ton to choose from. Um, you can go ahead and pick off any ones that you wanted to get as well. But this is what we're looking for today. This is the release hub. Um, to get the best out of Release Hub, it does say it along here that you probably do want uh, a Daybreak account, but that's for another video. For now, you can just go ahead and click on it, press Install, it'll download. We'll get a little notification down here to say it's enabled, and then you're good to go. So if you found the video uh, of any use, it was helpful, it helped you to achieve what you wanted to do, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button, leave me a comment, and most of all, please hit the subscribe button. That helps us to grow. The bigger we get, the more content you get. We'll see you guys in the next video.